The first thing to do is summon the Avengers. Big Bang or Community? I like them both. Marvel or DC? Marvel. I got the idea for it in college. I just had like this really cool coffee shop that I like to go to uh, after I bought my books each week. So I would buy my books, go across the street, hang out at this shop that was just had a really chill, chill vibe. And she ended up closing her doors. Um, and then I was just kind of at a loss for where to go because I just really loved her shop. So it wasn't as easy as like, well, just find another comic book shop because I really felt like I lost something when she closed. So I was just thinking like, it would be cool if there was a space where it was a comic book store, you could buy your books, but you could stay, you could hang out, you could sit and hopefully like get into a fun conversation with somebody who's reading the same thing you are because I mean that's the whole basis of like English classes and literature classes you read something you talk about it and you talk about the ideas that the, the book explores and so I, I was just thinking creating a space where stuff like that could happen. I started collecting when I was 13. Uh, I was telling people the two books that got me started collecting. Crisis on Infinite Earths number two, Thor 337. And you know, I was reading before then but those two I read them and was like, I have to know what happens next. To have a space that is designed for people to actually hang out, read a comic book, drink some coffee. It promotes literacy. It, it can be a family thing. The adults come in with their kids and they read a comic book and their kids read a comic book. I want this space to be a community space. Like that's what I call it, like an inclusive community geek space where no matter what your thing is, you know you're welcome here, you know you will most likely find somebody else who geeks about it too and just uh, be able to have like that personal interaction with someone and you can think on and it'll like encourage you for your day and it's like I'm having a bad day but I remember when like Storm lost her powers and she still you know was a badass. On the larger scale you know it's entertainment. I think it's still something, something um, meaningful in it and powerful in it. This venue, I think, is really important, first of all, because it's run by a woman. Um, that's really important right now. If anyone knows what's going on with the toy companies today, Ray just got cut out of the, I mean, the main character of Force Awakens just got cut out of all of the toy lines, and that is ridiculous. Women can be nerds. It doesn't hurt that we have coffee. You know, it does not hurt. So, you know, I think bringing the two together just sort of creates a, and you know, in such a great space, creates an ability, a, a space for people to just kind of come enjoy the thing that they enjoy with like-minded people. Some people just feel uncomfortable going into comic book stores. So if you don't know anything and you, you know, you're at the comic book store and your neighborhood is snobby and you know if you go in and ask a question, they are rolling their eyes because you don't know 50 years of Batman's history, this store is not like that. Like that is not our attitude no matter if you, you've been collecting comic books for 60 years or you just saw, you know, Guardians of the Galaxy and now you want to like read something, you know, you, we will treat you with the same level of respect and help you find what you want or what works for you or, or the type of like book or reading experience you enjoy. Being that community space, being a place where those things, those connections can happen and, you know, I hope we are able to get bigger, get better, you know, tournaments and movie events and you know who knows I mean we I think we have a lot of potential you know what is the next step I don't a hundred percent know because I'm just kind of rejoicing the fact that we got this far I've got two degrees in administration and justice so I could be doing other things but I love this I love this to death <laughs>